Hey everybody, Shane here from the Artisan Channel, and today we're making cookies. To begin things off, we're gonna set it at a nice 350. It should be noted that stirring is not my favorite part, because I typically make a mess. But just stir. Stir like you stir your macaroni and cheese after a good day's work. And because this is going to be kind of an experimental project, I'm not going to be following rules exactly. So I'm going to stir it into it's a nice thick paste. I'm sorry for any the noise, it's not loud. I mean, just clumping all this together. I can't even see the peppermints. That's good. But you can surely taste them. That's what I'm going for. Well, it's come to my attention that the mix may be a little too streamy. But yeah, here we go. Yes. Look at this. You can't see it, but it's locked. But oh, oh, it's brilliant. Cookies. Brownie bit peppermint cookies. Oh, brilliance. Ah, it's streaming. Let's put some. Oh. Oh, brilliant. Because of the piping bag issue, I've decided to go ahead and make brownies. And this is the finished product. Sort of. I gotta put it in the oil, then the burger herpa in the oven. So, let's go. They go in the oven for about 33 minutes, I might say. I do hope that can hold up, because aluminum seems very flimsy. Alright, let's get ready. Oh no. Okay. Flimsy, flimsy aluminum. Perfect peppermint brownie cake. 